everyone and welcome back. If you saw my previous video of getting the worm out, I don't have access to any athletic tape. So this is going to be a little experiment. I have a fresh brand new plant, uh, straight neck heirloom squash, which seems to be the same one that was in that bucket. I'm doing this video right after I dropped the worm. I didn't refine it, but I stabbed the whole area. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap this whole stem, even there, up. And let's see how that goes. So let me bring you up a minute. Or bring you down, I should say. Right to there. So athletic tape is what Rachel from the 1870s homestead recommended. I don't have access to that right now, so I want to get this one in the pot. I cleaned that up, and I want to thoroughly go around the root as best as possible with foil as a deterrent so it cannot get to my plants. I may even go up to here with foil and then... We'll see how this one does. It's so discouraging to lose a plant that was only two weeks old, to be exact. Okay, so I wrapped it all the way up, and I am going to plant it just like this. So, I do have a seedling in there growing right there. And I have the hole, but I want to put a little fertilizer in there first, and then I'm going to put it in that hole. Hang tight a second. And that's why I always have pretty hands. I just want to replenish spot where it was and I made sure I dug down and I got the entire roots everything that had to do with that other plant out so without messing up my seedling hopefully you can see let me raise you up a little bit there we go we'll see if this works And I just added wood mulch yesterday and didn't, because I knew that storm was coming, didn't see anything weak or, you know, surprising. The only thing I could do, I think, is go up another strip of foil. So let me rip a piece. Apparently foil is a deterrent, but I can't guarantee you that that's going to work. That's what Rachel had tried, and apparently it didn't work if she moved on to athletic tape. I'm going to go around even further with the foil. Pinch it on there real good. Bring the mulch up some. And there we go. So... I will have to keep you posted on how this one does and see if it actually works. I'll put a little bit more mulch around it, but there it is with the foil on it and hopefully this one doesn't get destroyed. So that's my video for the day, trying an experiment until I get some stretchable athletic tape, I think is what it's called, uh, to put around my zucchini plants. So that's my video today. Um, like I said, I will get back to you and let you know how this foil works out. I just have a funny feeling it's not going to because she used to use foil 
and she's moved on to bigger and better things but what the heck um, I wanted to get it in the pot now so I'll try the foil this time around and I'll let you know how things go so you know the routine like share subscribe and uh, yeah I will see you on the next video bye bye everyone